explores Italy's bold plan for investing in Africa. In 2023, Africa gained global attention as nations formed alliances with African counterparts. This video delves into Prime Minister Giorgia Maloney's plan, named after Dr. Enrico Mattei, to position Italy as an energy hub and address the issue of irregular migration from North Africa. It highlights the potential benefits and challenges of this strategic initiative. Africa's influence on the global stage cannot be overlooked. Prime Minister Maloney affirmed that Africa will be a priority during Italy's G7 presidency in 2024. This commitment reflects a growing awareness of Africa's potential and the need for international collaboration. The plan emphasizes the significance of fostering cooperative relationships with African nations, signaling a shift towards inclusivity and shared development goals. The heart of Italy's strategy lies in the Mate Plan, named after Dr. Enrico Mate, the founder of Italy's state-owned energy giant. This comprehensive plan aims to position Italy as a pivotal energy hub while addressing the root causes of irregular migration. The plan encompasses a wide range of sectors, including energy, agriculture, water, healthcare, and education in African nations. This holistic approach seeks to create a sustainable and mutually beneficial partnership between Italy and African countries. One key aspect of the MATE plan is the focus on energy. Italy aims to capitalize on Africa's abundant energy resources, positioning itself as Europe's natural energy hub. This strategic move aligns with Europe's efforts to reduce dependence on Russian oil and gas following the invasion of Ukraine. By channeling energy from Africa to Europe, Italy seeks to strengthen its role in the global energy landscape and enhance energy security for both continents. The MATE plan also addresses the pressing issue of irregular migration from North Africa. Italy, acknowledging the interconnectedness of migration and economic opportunities, proposes a strategic alliance with African nations. This alliance aims to tackle the root causes of migration by fostering economic development and stability in African countries. It emphasizes cooperation over exploitation, reflecting a commitment to creating lasting solutions. The initial funding for the MATE plan amounts to $5.9 billion, with a portion designated as loans. This financial commitment underscores Italy's seriousness in implementing the plan and catalyzing sustainable development in African nations. This explores the potential impact of this funding on various sectors, from establishing vocational training centers to enhancing healthcare accessibility. Giulio Tremonti, the president of the Foreign Affairs Committee in the Italian Chamber of Deputies, envisions Italy as a bridge between Africa and Europe. This metaphorical bridge aims to channel energy north while fostering investments in the south. The strategic positioning of Italy as a facilitator of economic exchange seeks to curb migrant departures across the Mediterranean Sea and promote balanced development. To address the humanitarian aspect of irregular migration, Prime Minister Maloney emphasizes the fight against human trafficking. The plan details initiatives to train coast guards in North Africa, aiming to deter migrants from perilous journeys across the Mediterranean. Additionally, Maloney suggests establishing readmission agreements with countries of origin, facilitating the repatriation of illegal migrants through lawful channels. The Mate Plan's scope extends beyond energy and migration to encompass vital sectors like education and healthcare. Pilot projects include the establishment of a vocational training center for renewable energy in Morocco, educational initiatives in Tunisia, and efforts to enhance healthcare accessibility in Ivory Coast. These initiatives aim to create sustainable opportunities and improve the overall well being of African communities. Italy's strategic initiative to position itself as Europe's natural energy hub comes in the aftermath of Europe's vulnerability exposed during Russia's invasion of Ukraine in 2022. The plan delves into the broader context of Europe's efforts to decrease reliance on Russian oil and gas. Italy's plan aligns with these geopolitical considerations, offering a potential alternative energy source that benefits both continents.
Prime Minister Maloney's vision for Italy's foreign policy decision is clear. Prioritize Africa during the G7 presidency. The plan explores how this commitment aligns with Maloney's broader campaign focused on diminishing illegal migration. The Matei plan becomes a crucial instrument in translating these priorities into concrete actions that address the root causes of migration. While the Matei plan holds promise for reducing illegal migration and fostering development, it emphasizes the need for caution. History has shown that Western and European nations have often exploited African resources under the pretext of investment opportunities. Africa must remain vigilant, ensuring that these deals genuinely benefit its nations and populations rather than masking another form of exploitation. In conclusion, Italy's strategic investment plan for Africa, as outlined in the Mate plan, presents a multifaceted approach to address energy challenges and irregular migration. This explores the potential benefits of this initiative, from enhancing energy security to fostering economic development in African nations. However, it also highlights the importance of vigilance to prevent exploitation and ensure that these partnerships genuinely contribute to the well-being of African communities. As Italy positions itself as a bridge between continents, the success of the Mate plan hinges on the commitment to cooperation and shared prosperity. Thank you for joining us on Africa Info Hub. Kindly stay informed, share your thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe for more nuanced perspectives on Africa's geopolitical landscape.